Breaking us, we begin with breaking news in Greenville, where crews are on the scene of a train derailment. Several roads are closed in the area, along with the Swamp Rabbit Trail. 7 News' Kelsey O'Donnell is joining us live now with more information on this. So, Kelsey, what area are you in? Well, Amy, right now we're in the Buncombe Road area. I actually want to show you exactly what we're seeing here behind me. This is the train that actually derailed. It's a Norfolk Southern train, and Parker District Fire Department said it that call came in this morning around 8 o'clock when they first arrived here. They quickly determined that there were only three train cars that actually derailed and they were actually empty. So, so far, things are going well with the cleanup. They said there are no reported injuries. However, there is still a lot for them to do. Right now, there's several roads that are closed in this area as Norfolk Southern comes in and takes over. And right now, their main priority is checking to make sure there are no other leaks in the area. At this point here, the rail um, owners are on scene and they're bringing their support agencies into the area at this point, um, hazmat teams, uh, security teams and so forth. Um, and that's where we are. We, they've, they've said it's not leaking. We're, we're doing one more safety check. So Chief Parley spoke to us here this morning and he said right now there's several hazmat crews in the area, several Greenville County Emergency Management, as well as the Parker District Fire Department. Their response is pretty much slowing down now and Norfolk Southern will begin to take over their response now and try to get those trains cleaned up and everything out back and moving. As for a timeline, they said this could take several days and the roads surrounding us, so Old Buncombe Road at Buncombe Road, even a part of the Swamp Rabbit Trail will be closed until it is safe for people to go across them as well. For now, we're live in Greenville, Kelsey O'Donnell, 7 News.